First, fighting out of the blue corner train out of Mac 1. He officially weighed in at 58.8 kilograms. This is his debut. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Tommy Harrison. And his opponent trained out of MFC. He officially weighed in at 58.8 kilograms. This is his debut. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Blade Fury Townsend. Blade definitely the um, taller fighter. Maybe a longer reach as well. Tommy looks intent to go though, man. <laughs> they both look it. <laughs> Maybe the most intense match of the night so far. Abby calling out for a jab to open up the fight. And I think um, Blade's going to come in all, all fire as soon. Good jab. Like we said, that. Ooh. Good insight. Good jab. One, two from Tommy. <laughs> I want to change to southpaw. Blade's reading the distance really well. Especially being the long, yeah, yeah, especially being the longer fighter. Yeah. Still three three minute rounds. No takedown attempts yet. Training leg kicks. Ooh. There's the takedown. Ooh, what's oh, what's the team there? Blade looking for it straight away. Up. Good defense there by Tommy and really relentless on that single leg. Straight Great. to his corner. Great takedown defense. Pushing control in the head. And Tommy's just relentless. A lot of energy, man. man. A lot of energy here. Can he spin him back the other way though? Oh, beautiful. Well done by Blade there. Beautiful job by Blade. Good takedown defense. Jab by Blade. Good composure by Blade. Yeah. He's definitely very composed. Looked like he was going to come out and kill him, but so far composed. Oh, oh good head kick there. Needs a bit more work rate though. Not very active. Tommy definitely doing the majority of the work at the moment. Body kick, training body kicks. Oh, Blade trying to push him back. Oh. Good push kick. Oh, oh, good right hand. Ooh. Just ducked under that overhand. Oh, good right hand. That oh, one hurt Tommy, him, man. Oh. That, hurt him. that right hand hurt him. Blade looking Locks for that guillotine hands. again. Oh, huge oh. slam right into the guillotine. Oh, he's out. Him. His head's yeah. out. He's, he's safe there. He's not on the neck, yeah. yeah. Call it, uh, his corner calling for a scissor sweep. A scissor sweep? Yeah. From the bottom. From the bottom. In MMA. Maybe a potential thing there because you can kind of use the glove to, to use it. But yeah, I'd like okay. to see him do that, push his hips up and. and we'll have that pressure by Tommy. He's still looking for that guillotine. guillotine. Yeah. yeah, he's still looking for that guillotine, Maybe man. It's, Maybe that's his thing. Those long yeah. arms, yeah. those darses, those other corners can slip in. Well done by Tommy to secure the takedown. Blade breathing heavy and looking towards his quarter here. Oh, well done. Move straight to mount. See if he can land some big Oh, straight to the back. back. He's going to slip Looks off. Like he might slip off the top. Yeah. Good oh, job well by done. Blade. Oh, and a knee. 30 Tommy, seconds left. Tommy looking like he's breathing a bit heavy. Both of these fighters are a little bit. I mean, the work rate for these flyweights is uh, quite high. Yeah. Oh, oh head kick. Head kick. Beautiful leg kick. Blade needs to establish his distance a little oh, bit. Oh, big right hand just missed by Tommy. Ten more seconds. Good knee on the inside. Oh, good right hand. Another right hand. Oh, oh and a jab. He's trying to talk and he got yeah. clipped. Oh. <laughs> That's the downside of talking, man. You're in a fight. Yeah. Sometimes uh, you know that can translate across from the bigger leagues. The Nate Diaz is the George Masvidal's. These guys that talk in the cage. Sometimes not the best idea. Yeah, yeah. There's a time. There's a place. In a fight, probably not the best place. No. But who knows? Maybe that's Blade's move. Yeah, look to look look for the guillotine a lot when he was. Um, Shooting on the on the shooting for the takedown. Like I said, I mean, he trains a lot with Liam Hoskin. Liam really his last fight by, you know, uh, an anaconda variation. Long arms do yeah. translate well to those uh, yeah, yeah, those blood sure. chokes. The yeah, anaconda, the dars, the guillotine. If you have the right positioning, yeah. but 
he's tried twice, three times now, and Tommy's got the takedown all three times. Yeah. I think this maybe he's trying to sprawl. Give Tommy something else to worry yeah. about, then go for the choke, you know? Yeah, and yeah. it needs to establish his jab a bit more and get the distance under control and get, get Tommy to respect him a bit more. Big support for Tommy. Yeah, yeah. big crowd contingent at the back. Fighters touch gloves. Leg kick by Tommy Star. Some nice welts on his body there, Blade. That might be to his skin complexion, maybe he's a little <laughs> bit pale in there. No offense, Blade. Tans don't make fighters, mate. Don't worry about it. Oh, good spinning kick. I'd like to see him follow it up, though. The follow oh. up there. Nice right hand by Tommy. Let's see if he looks for the double leg here, Tommy. Tommy looking for the... Oh! oh. oh good and again, cover. straight back to that guillotine, but relentless by yeah. Tommy. Can he pass over? No. See if he's got some arsenal. Potentially, he's got those long legs as well. Maybe triangles. Yeah, he can I, throw up. I think he needs to try and get up, mate. Yeah, it looks like he's trying, man. See if Tommy can look to posture up. Maybe get past his legs. This could be the issue there. The, the size difference in the guard. It's going to be a lot harder for Tommy to posture up correctly and still land strikes. Yeah. When that space is created, that's where Blade needs to put the feet on the hips and try and just stand up. That's what I'm talking about. But he didn't move. He needs to create that space yeah. and move. Wall walk so that when Tommy comes back in. They meet halfway through the cage on the floor. Yeah, and fight for that underhook, I think, is key as they push off. If you can get the underhook, come to his knees and potentially then um, stand up or use it to reverse. But sitting on your back there, easier said than done. That's it, man. Is not the, the best thing. Now he's looking for that guillotine again, man. But it doesn't really have no, his legs. It's on the face, posture, yeah. yeah. Just wasting his energy. Tommy needs to get past those legs. Let's see him get into half guard. Blade's corner calling for him to get up. I think he's trying. There's a triangle attempt. Triangle attempt. Yeah, watch the triangle. Well done. Good posture. Yeah, yeah it's better, but stand up. That's it. I think Tommy can smell blood here. Tommy's working, man. He yeah, works. he can sure. really smell the blood. Yeah. He's aware of that guillotine now. He's got to change the strategy Good up. on the inside there. Picks him up. Hey, oh, huge slam. slam. And goes to. Oh, oh look at Half the guard. welt underneath Blade's leg there, too. Those leg kicks are paying dividends, yeah, man. Even man. through the shin guards, look. Is that his complexion, though, or is that, <laughs> is that the welt? Blade, you're going to have to follow up with us after this, mate. <laughs> that leg's open. You can pass him out. Yeah. And take the back again. Can he stabilize the position here? Yeah, there we go. The mount. There's well the mount. Good. Right He's got 20 in. seconds to work. That's oh, it. He could get a finish time. here. Diego looking close. I think actually he needs to flatten yeah, him out. Flatten him out and just make him pay now. Good. Well done. 10 seconds. Let's see. Can he survive? I think he's going to survive the round, but well. Tommy's, de uh, Tommy's definitely winning this fight. Yeah, that's for sure. And this is a real confidence booster for Tommy going into round three. Tommy looks tired, man. Took a lot out of him, but how much did it take out of Blade? Blade's got to be down two rounds. He's got to come out in the next one. He needs All to finish. Blade. Fighters yeah. get one minute rest in between rounds, ladies and gents, if you're wondering at home. Hilton, tell the lovely people at home how fast that minute goes. Man, you, <laughs> it's a very difficult concept to explain. I've tried to explain it. But basically, you get a bit of composure. You don't really hear what else is going on, and then before you know it, they tap you on the ass like, all right, man, let's go round right, three. Right, yep. And then that's pretty much it. But I feel like as your experience grows, you get to take that minute a little bit longer and then realize, oh, I'll try to take some advice from it. Here we go. Round three. Oh, round two, sorry. 
Right, let's see if Blade can make a big difference in there. You've got to go for the finish, man. Got to leave it out. Oh, there's that spinning kick again. Is round two or round three? It's round three. Is it? Yeah, it's definitely round three, man. Just says, yeah, they changed it. There we go. There for we all go. of you playing yeah. at home. Beautiful little Eternal logo in the corner there. Yeah, good job. Oh, oh that's what he needs. Missed. Oh. Yeah, and Tom Tommy's just looking to close the distance and then look for that takedown again, man. Tommy could get Tim to the back here again. Back, yeah. yeah. Get to the back. And fighting for that underhook. Well done. Yep, and then turn him off the cage and a knee. Calling, calling for a knee. Good leg kick again. I would like to see Blade look for that head kick again. It just missed, man. But set it up a bit. Double jab, then maybe a head kick. Or, yeah, just to set it up. Tommy knows he's in front, man. Tommy knows he doesn't have to take any risks. Just keep playing the same game he's been playing. Yeah, Cody being the more aggressive. Sorry, Blade being the more aggressive fighter now. Oh, we do have Cody Hatter on this. Oh, count. oh, there we go. Don't we? Yeah, that one I'm looking for. That's going to be a bar burner, boy. Always good when he fights that guy. Here we go. Tommy looking for the big right hand. Oh, Blade's got to get off the cage here. And see if he looks. Oh, good right hand. Oh, and, and a jab. jab. Oh, oh, and another, and another one. one. Oh, oh, and another one. Him, I think. He took those well, him, but yeah. caught him. big shots. He's got to pummel inside now to try to get those, rid of those double underhooks. Let's see if Blake can take the back here, potentially. Pop his head underneath. Oh, well done. Tommy turns off the cage and puts the pressure on straight away, man. Good Tommy's job. look really good, oh, man. Oh, there you go. There by Blake. That's what I'd like to see more. Blake's got a one, minute two. to make something happen, man. Yeah. A minute to, to take this one out. Good shot by Tommy. Is that again? Yeah. See if he can change the corner. Right in front of us here. And, yeah. Locks his hands just and he can really that. just... He's looking for a guillotine. No, he's out of it, man. Again, same same issue there. Yeah. He's got 40 seconds. The thing is, is Tommy could just sit here and this fight says, man, he doesn't really have to do anything. No. For, for Blade, he's got to work, man. He's got to come up with something, get back to his feet, pull a triangle up. Do something, an armbar, something. Let's get his posture up and land some damage. Ten seconds left. Ten seconds. Great performance by Tommy Harrison here. Yeah. This corner's going to be extremely proud of him. And the crowd is going to go wild, I'm going to say. Oh! oh. Great respect. Yeah, for, uh, huge respect. Between fighters. What do you think, Hilton? Yeah, you can't not see. Can only go one yeah, way, right? Can only go one, man. Tommy just shut him down. Too much pressure. Blade not happy with his performance, just walked over to the promoter. It's Blade to me, sorry, let him down. Yeah, he also knows. Tommy, just too much pressure, man. Yeah. Coming forward, good jabs, overhand rights, good everywhere. takedowns. Yeah. And uh, Blade just didn't have an answer, couldn't get back up to his feet. After three rounds, we head into the judges for a decision. All three judges score at 30 27 for your winner by unanimous decision out of the blue corner, Tommy Harrison. Fight number five. Good prospect there, man. Tommy Harrison, one yeah, to watch. Yeah.